Hi guys, so, well, hey, welcome back to my channel. Uh, that's the thing that I've been thinking about recently, like, how do I start my videos? Like, do I do like, hey guys, hey, welcome back to my channel, that kind of thing. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I look, I look horrendous. Um, but I was just like, hmm, I'm going to film a video. So I sat down and I was just like, yeah. So I set up my camera and I'm I'm away. So I've not done my hair. I haven't even brushed it today, and I haven't done any makeup. And I'm still I'm in my dressing gown and a vest while I film this because I'm quite hot right now. So yeah, I don't know why, but I'm quite warm. Um, right. So I'm just looking around to see if I've got everything. But I'm going to be doing a handbag collection. Now this includes um, handbags, suitcase, purse is that kind of thing I have one suitcase crap ton of bags and like I think two purses that I found somewhere and I have them all like on here so I'm gonna start with my suitcase because that is like one of the biggest that's like the biggest it's like I'm right on top of my pile right now so oh this is like kind of heavy but um I've mentioned this in some of the videos I think but I'm going I'm actually going on holiday next Wednesday um and this is my suitcase. I when I go on holiday, I travel on with cabin luggage, um, so I get like a small suitcase and I fit everything there. Um, mainly because the only place I've been recently is is um, Spain because my grandparents have a house, so we just go. We just take like a couple of pairs of pants and a couple of t-shirts and that does us because we have like a washing machine and stuff like that so we don't need to take like a whole heap of stuff so I condense everything into this little suitcase I'm just probably thinking what that's like really smart but yeah this is just my suitcase it is the um Kipling Tegan extra small um and it just has like the two two wheels on the bottom um I this is my first ever suitcase that is like actually mine that I'll actually travel with. Um so this is like completely mine, all mine, it stays in my bedroom, that kind of thing, and that's that hence the reason why I got it in purple. Um but this is the colour is described well, it's called Dark Arberg, um which is kinda of like an aubergine colour. I actually have like my curtains are kind of the same colour and stuff like that. So I've kind of things that are like the same colour as the suitcase. But I really like it and yeah, it has like a handle here and then it has like the like the pulley handle that comes out like the top bit here. And then it has like what I was thinking about because there was some suitcases that had like um like a full zip pocket and then smaller pockets on the front to put stuff in. Um I like to have somewhere where I can put my documents for like easy reach like um passport and um health health insurance stuff like that. So this suitcase actually has a velcro pocket on the back and I just have like my insurance documents and I also have a pair of headphones in here because I haven't properly sorted this out. Um, it is Friday um, and I go next Wednesday so I probably sort it out like Monday, Tuesday because um, I'm staying with my friend at my grandparents house in this country um, Tuesday night and then Wednesday I go so I have time to sort it out like maybe Monday, Tuesday I know I'm getting like my nails done for my holiday and stuff like that and I need to go to the bank and everything like that so um I've got a few errands to run on Tuesday, so I probably I probably need to sort this out. But I have kind of sorted it out. It's kind of all like in there, kind of somewhat organised. But yeah. And if you are familiar with Kipling bags, they do come with like um a little monkey keyring. I have other Kipling bags that have like the monkey on them, but this monkey is called Mia. So super cute but all the monkeys have like different names which is really cool um but this one's called Mia and yeah that is just what my suitcase looks like um that for what it was for the size of it is kind of expensive it was I think about 57 pounds um but it did have money knocked off so if I hadn't got it with like the money off um it would have been about 90 to 100 pounds something like that so yeah um 
that is my suitcase. Now onto my bags. Uh, these are in no particular order. I just when I see a cute bag, I pick it up. Kind of thing. So the thing that I am seeing right now is actually from Primark. I got this intended for my holiday, um, because um, I usually fly with Ryanair, and now they've started doing like you can have your cabin suitcase and you can have like your purse, like your bag, like your handbag. Um, but now this year I'm going with EasyJet, and your your handbag has to fit in your suitcase. So the original plan was to go with this, and then. Anything that would fit my suitcase when I came home, I could like roll up really small and put in here. Um, but this is just what it looks like. It's like blue on one side and then blue and white stripes on the other. And it just have like blah blah blah. Just has like um, brown trim. So like brown handles and brown trim around here. And then it's really big inside, which is hence the reason why I decided that I was going to use it for my holiday. But now that is not the case. But that is just what it looks like inside. So it's really big and... Yeah, so that's just from Primark. Um, the next one I have, let me just think. Some bad one. Um, this is a Kipling bag. I believe this is like my first Kipling, so it's a kind of dirty at the top here. Um, but that's just what it looks like. It has these handles. Um, it has a pocket on the front, right here, which has um like a thing for your keyring. It has like bits for pens and a bit for your phone and all that kind of jazz um the next pocket it has is here so there's the zip and then there's a pocket in here so it just has that and then it has the zip pocket and then currently inside here i just have it's like long strap um and it just has like a zip pocket in there and then it has another pocket here and then it also has another pocket here so yeah but it's just like it's like baby kind of pink colour yeah and it has like the little clips on here for you to clip your yeah, handle to um, and it also has a little pocket here and a little pocket here and like I said with the suitcase they do come with monkeys and this is a monkey for this one and it is called Esme. Not Esme, Esme, Esme. Something like that. That kind of thing. But yeah. That is a Kipling. Uh, the next Kipling bag I have. I forgot. Oops. The next Kipling bag I have is this one. Uh, and it has like the. It's twisted. It has like the long strap. Um, and it has a pocket on the front here so you it has two pockets there and it has like this flap and then it has a big pocket here and inside it has one of those like key things and then it has a pocket for your phone a bigger pocket pockets for pens and a zip pocket it's quite big i use i use this as like a handbag when i went to norway so i could like fit everything in so that's just what that looks like and this monkey is called elena Ele eleanor Ella, which is like super cute so yeah that is that one. It is purple, but it comes off a bit more blue on camera. But it is purple. So the next one I have, the next bag I have is it's kind of like a funny thing with this one. So I was in like a shopping centre, like like an hour or so away from me, and I'd seen this bag, and I was like, and then I went, I got home, and I went online, and I found it, and it's about forty something pound, which is quite expensive the bag but it's really pretty it's super pretty and i haven't really worn it like i really really wanted it but i haven't really worn it um it's more of like a summer kind of bag uh, this is just what it looks like it's kind of out of shape so i've like been starring it weird but that's just kind of what it looks like and it has like all these like like these cut out flowers and super pretty and this is actually a lipsy bag um so it has like the plaque that says lipsy on it um has the handles you do have the option to make the bag bigger or smaller using these zips on like the sides so yeah but inside if i just undo the zips inside it's just like pink and it has like a zip pocket and then a pocket for your phone stuff like that and it just like it clicks shut basically like that so 
that is that one um the next bag i have i have like 10 minutes left on my camera i hope i make it and i have really itchy nails okay um the next bag i have is actually from primark like i buy most of my bags from like um primark some are from river island some from kipling um I have a couple from next i have some from ted baker but if i just if i go somewhere and i see something cute then i pick it up so yeah so this is my bag it's kind of like if you see that it's um not straight and i i've had it for that long that i just don't even care but it just looks like that and it has like handle and then it has like a long strap um with the bow on the front and then it just has like a little clasp thing and then you lift it up and then inside there it just has like a zippy pocket and then that's it really <laughs> nothing more to say about that but yeah i sometimes i wear this sometimes with like a leather jacket boots stuff like that so that's that um the next item i have i want to go on to this one because this is like one that's like really full and it's just looking at me right now so this bag is from um river island and it has like the, the little river island thing this zip it works but it's not actually like a pocket because it's like it's not but yeah um this actually has if you know what that is it actually has everything in here so it has like um documents from work um because i have like a, i'm starting like a new job when i come back off my holiday um so i have like all that and i have um my maths and english gcse results which i just picked up yesterday um to be honest i some people are like oh you didn't you didn't do very well you did crap but compared to what i did at school i did quite well um i got a d uh, for maths and english um, and I did get an E at school, which I'm, I was like, I cried. I was like so happy that I'd even got a D. Uh, I thought I'd failed again, but yeah, got a D. That's about it. And then there's just like things for like my agency that I work for and stuff like that. And then also in here, I have my purse, which I'll run through in a moment. And I also have, I have like six packets of these and I have a roll on deodorant and, um, my house keys and i have that's it that's it's these are for those in there are for my holiday just just put that out there um which i should probably take out actually or like just i'm just gonna throw them i'm gonna throw them somewhere i don't need these in here i've just taken out a milkshake bottle <laughs> um my keys but yeah this is just from river island it has this strap here and this strap here is actually off a different bag, uh, which I'll show you. But I just I wanted a longer strap for this bag because my other my long strap that actually came with this bag it broke. Um, so I took this strap off a different bag. So yeah, but in here um, there's just a pocket for your phone and a zippy pocket, and yeah, that's about it really. So yeah, so I have that one. Um, onto my getting comfortable onto my purse um this one with ryan actually goes with that bag so it's like if i'm finding the bag i want the purse so yeah that just goes with that um in here i just currently have um that doesn't even go in there but i have in here my bank card provisional license at the back there i have a kfc members card i like chicken um i have my sub card my, like my subway card and then i have a h and v card there um a new look card with like one pounds and one pence on it which is like wow but they have like some really cute stuff in there right now they have like a jumper that i really really want and i'm just like i've got no money i was paid today though but i can't buy anything until i come back off my holiday which kind of sucks but yeah um i also have a boots card in there and then I just have like change. Oh, I have one pound. Yay. I found a pound in my purse. It's a happy moment. Um, but I will not be taking this on my holiday because it's too big. It doesn't fit in the bag that I'm taking. Um, but yeah. I'm have to make this into a part two, to be honest. Because I'm... 
I'm just struggling right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna do part two because I'm like I'm I've got like five minutes. I've got, I'm not gonna do the rest of this in five minutes. So yeah, but um, next Tuesday I will take out of here my ID and my card uh, and any change. And then when I go on my holiday, I will leave this here and I'll take my other pass. So yeah, I'm just gonna stick this in up here so I know what it is. Um, but yeah, that is it for part one. They in bags. <laughs> I have too many bags. I can't even cope. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do the rest of my bags in a minute. I would say. I'll see you in a bit.